Hey, what's up guys? I'm Chris with heavyheadsrecords.com. Today I'm doing a punk drop. I've got nine punk pieces. I got a special record in the middle of all those to show you as well. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick flip video if you don't wanna hear me talk the, the rest of the time and see condition. You can check these out on our Discogs page. Uh, we've got a really convenient button on our website, heavyheadsrecords.com, it'll get you right there. And uh, links will be down in the description as well for you. So let's get rolling. Let's check out some punk vinyl. First on the list is Agent Orange. This is the voice. Uh, Agent Orange is kind of surf punk rock. You can see the cover front and back here. I've got that cover listed at VG. So, and uh, bonus points here. It's a gold stamp promo. All right, and let's go ahead and look at the vinyl inside. Of course, it's got the uh, plastic sleeve inside. I won't pull that out nothing to it but also got some order forms let's look at those first og order forms all right got a crease on the album cover too right there but still i think i think vg is a pretty fair grade there's the spine all right let's get the record out got this at uh what vg plus In the description, handful of very light surface marks gives this one VG+. Plus. Outer sleeve is on the high side of VG. So if you can see surface marks, uh, great, because they are there. But as you can see, they're pretty light. Nothing super, super noticeable that I can see through this video. So I'm really harsh on my grading. I do not like returns. Hate it. I want you to be happy the first time. I don't want to do extra work. I've got this one listed at VG on the media, VG plus on the sleeve. I think that's a fair assessment. VG plus, no ring wear. I mean, that's that's high VG plus too. I, I would go almost near mint on that. Again, very critical of my grading. Let's check out the record. No inserts, I don't think. Make sure. No inserts. Now. Now, I've graded this one uh, VG. There are just a couple surface marks. Okay, that was not a surface mark. It's a piece of fuzz. Handful of surface marks give this one VG as well. That's what I said. Man, I, I do see a couple marks. There's one right here, if you could see it. It's a hairline. I'd probably regrade this VG+. Plus. I may do that, but it's, it's in really great shape, guys. Really great. Also an original. So check it out. Check out the Discogs page. And let's continue. Next up is this 84 original of My War. So I've got the uh, got the media listed at VG Plus and the sleeve at VG. Uh, it's probably due to some of these defects here, some of the ring wear, high VG for sure. Some wrinkles, uh, some creases up here on top and stuff like that. But really for the year, got a, a wrinkle here, but for the year and everything, um, great shape especially for punk records um i don't know if you've been collecting for a while I've, you've seen some pretty crazy punk records i have too so not always in the best condition um so there we go on that on the outer sleeve basic inner sleeve no insert and we've got that nice yellow label a little piece of fuzz there vg plus on this one as I'm looking, could be arguably near mint on this side, is arguably near mint on this side. Let's check out the other side. Man, that's the highest VG plus I've ever seen. It doesn't even look like it's got spindle marks. Just a couple little 
little paper scuffs there. You can't even hardly see them. You run a needle over it, you're not going to hear it. I'm just super, super picky. And I know you are too, especially when you're spending good money on a record. Okay, we're going in alphabetical order, not necessarily chronological order. Here's the Cramps Flame Job. And this is a 94 pressing. Um, what is special about it? Well, first of all, what's special, it's still in the shrink, which is awesome. I've got the sleeve listed as near mint. Basic inner sleeve, no inserts. Ooh, ooh, red vinyl. Specialty pressing. And I've got this one listed as VG+. Plus. VG+. Plus. It's got just a couple... Looks like paper scuffs there. You can't even, can't even hardly see them. They are there, but you're not going to have any problems at all playing this record. I guarantee that. Little cat hair there took care of it for you. Cramps uh, are basically punk rock. They got a little bit of rockabilly sound to them, um, mixed with some surf rock. They incorporated um, some horror into their stuff. And uh, just a really, really cool band. So um, if you're not into the cramps, check them out. And now we got, uh, how about Gravest Hits? Okay, so this one is, uh, I've actually graded it VG all the way around. I'm sorry, VG plus all the way around. Um, I'm glad, because that's that cover deserves VG plus. So uh, there's the spine for you. A little bit of discoloration on the spine. I see a green dot. That's code for something. I'm not sure what, but I'm going to leave it on there. You can tear it off if you'd like. Um, got the back, of course. And let's get in, check the vinyl out. Basic inner sleeve. Really cool label. Colorful label. VG Plus on the vinyl. Probably could get near mint. Again. Now, I will say my, my prices do reflect. Oh, I see a hairline. There's a hairline right there. My prices do reflect the condition, you know? So my price might be a little higher than somebody that has it in the same condition. What's your peace of mind worth? Got the video. Got everything. I do, uh, I do also put a lot of these up for offers, too. I'll accept reasonable offers. I deal with enough low ballers uh, on a daily basis that I, I don't don't waste a lot of time on low ballers. I'll put it that way. Next up is the Cramps Fiends of Dope Island, and this one's really cool. As you can see, the really really glossy cover. Um, I uh, I graded that one VG plus. Arguably near mint very uh just well put together solid you're gonna like that sleeve you ready now this one came out in 2003 a little bit newer pressing and you can definitely tell and it's red by the way little bad spot right here you can see it there's just a few little marks i don't know if you can see it or not they're there little splotchy marks nothing nothing crazy of course might even be a little pressing defect if you will I got this at VG, arguably VG plus. Yeah. Another mark right there, but man, I may go in and change that. That's pretty dang good. Pretty dang good. More cramps. This time it's what's inside a girl. Something else about the cramps. I just love their album artwork. It's great. 
There's the spine of it. Media, near mint, sleeve, very good. Why? Got some creases down here. And just a little, some, some stress creases here. Nitpicky stuff. Could get VG plus probably. I want you to be happy. No inserts, but it is on white vinyl. That's from 1986, back when colored vinyl wasn't done for every release. And here's the other side for you. Near Mint is what I've got this one, and it's white. It's very, very hard to see. You're going to have to trust me on that. But hopefully after the others, uh, I've gained your trust on my grading. If I haven't, uh, I would suggest going over to our, uh, well, first of all, our Discogs feedback. Um, also, eBay feedback. All right, we got more crabs. This time, it's a date with Elvis. Uh, as you can see, the cover is very nice. I've listed this at VG+, plus, VG+. Plus, and spine's in good shape. Little, little doodad there. Looks like it might come off. That's a cat hair. <laughs> All right. Let's check out the inside. No inserts, anything like that. Let's see. If you can tell, there's a surface mark right here. I really want to get that to show up. A little difficult. Oh, it's right by my finger there. I'm hoping you can see it. So there's that mark, and I want to say that's the only mark on the record. Now, there's a couple little hairlines here. Those are the only marks on the record that I believe gave it the VG Plus rating. Basically, if it's got anything more than like one small hairline, um, it's out of the running for near mint when it comes to my grading. So there's a date with Elvis. Anybody out there ever had one of his sandwiches? It was like, it's like uh, peanut butter, banana, pickles, something. I never had. I should, I should try that. Ooh, next record. Ready? First of all, check out my shirt. This is uh, our unofficial sponsor for this video. They don't even know I'm doing this, of course, um, but I'm doing it anyway because I like them. Seen them a couple times. The Magic City Hippies. Uh, their latest release, Water Your Garden. Um, great band. Has nothing to do with punk rock. <laughs> but I grabbed them because I was wearing the shirt today. Figured I'd introduce you. And uh, great album artwork. All kinds of cool stuff there. Some lyrics. Last but not least, boom. Colored vinyl. These guys do a great job. Um, on, all their, on all their merch, but also live really dig them. Uh, their production's great. Check out the Magic City Hippies. Okay, next up, Sid Vicious, Love Kills, NYC. This one's in pretty darn good shape, too. And uh, this right here is going to show you um, which variant it is on Discogs. I'm going to go ahead and check out the record as well. Love this label. It's really, really cool. Like how they did that. Looks like this side is, man, I grade this side at near mint. Let's see. This side's gonna be not near mint. It's got just a few little paper scuffs here that you can see. That's gonna take it down to VG plus for me. Even if you can't see them on the video, um, you will see them when it gets to your house. I want to make sure you know they're there. Again, they won't affect play, but uh, yeah, they're right here. Right here, hairlines. Last but not least, it's Social Distortion Prison Bound. And I've graded this one VG+, plus, VG+. Plus. I think it deserves it. Very glossy cover. You can see that reflection in the light. Let's look at the spine. Very legible. Let's look inside. Ooh, we got a 
plastic sleeve on this one. Let's see about the inserts. Ooh, there is an insert in this one. We're gonna call that insert uh, near mint. And up, oh, up, oh, little corner ding right there, VG plus. Comes with it. If you buy it, if you buy the record, I'll throw it in. How's that? <laughs> All right, let's check out the condition of the vinyl. I've got VG plus down. Let's see what we got. Oh man. That side, a uh, little hairline, little hairline right there. Yep, I don't see anything on here. So, so that one hairline made it a VG plus. Probably could get near mint. Does have spindle marks, so we know it's been played. So, on the border of VG plus near mint. Very, very close. Proceed uh, how you want to based on that information. Once again, thank you for checking out the video. Thanks for uh, spending some time looking at vinyl with me. Um, if you saw anything you need, please hit the website. Again, it's heavyheadsrecords.com. Uh, there's a button right on the homepage that says Discogs. You can also get to our vinyl on our website, eBay, uh, cassette tapes, all kinds of stuff. Uh, is just right there on our website. And of course our premium stuff is over on Discogs, which is where this stuff will be for now. Um, go check it out. Please check out uh, my socials, Instagram, Facebook, all under Heavy Heads Records. Uh, actually Instagram's Heavy Heads Records 417. Uh, lots of good content on those. And uh, also don't forget to sign up for our mailing list um, that way you'll get uh, notifications about these drops as soon as they happen. I'll shoot you an email notification or click the bell uh, for YouTube. Subscribe to the channel, get notifications that way. I plan on doing a lot more of these. So, And check out my previous drops as well. Still got some good stuff out there. So I think that's it. Thanks again for watching. Um, check out my other videos and I will catch you next time.